really nice. Um, and uh, and I and thank you, and I take on board your thanks, and I, I and I really appreciate it. But uh, uh, without doubting the relevance of what you're communicating to me, I have to say yet again, George created that part, and it's him that the thanks go to. I'm not George. <laughs> I wanted to ask you, I design, I design and build costumes uh, mostly now theater and um, ballet, but some of the costumes that you just wear are really pretty awesome. And I was uh, working with actors, um, I'd like to do things to the costumes or give them something special that they relate to more strongly than others. So I'm wondering if you have any special feelings for any of the pieces that you wear. All, yeah, all of them. Who, um, Michelle, yeah, yeah, all of them. Michelle Clapton, who's um, uh, the brilliant costume designer on Game of Thrones. Um, I'm very interested in design, and uh, and it was very exciting to me to go into her, you know, costume department um, and look at all these references on the wall and. But also, I didn't know if I would be afforded the opportunity, but I certainly really wanted to have uh, to be involved in the decision making process of what Brienne would wear because I was just, you know, really excited and remain really excited about this part and like to be and want to be involved in every aspect of it. Um, and I, I had my ideas, and she very kindly took those on board. And Michelle Clapton and I have always been on the same page with regards to the way in which she should look, and about um, not making this character look like a man, but making her look like a woman in armour, mm -hmm. um, and 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 about it not being feminised, about it not being made deliberately more masculine but instead um is finding a middle ground and uh actually the 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 coat the undercoat that i first put on um that's based on uh, a very a very basic rough um design of of ned stark's coat so um i thought that was interesting um to start with in total coincidence but it's, um, it's, it's relevance was not lost on me. Um, and yeah, I mean, I just, I love, I don't, I really, I really, I get excited about putting the armor on and then I put the armor on and I feel incredible. And then about half an hour later, I'm going, I'm too heavy. <laughs> Why is it so heavy? <laughs> um, it's in service of the part, uh, nice, um, you know, medieval knights, uh, skeletons have been found and they've been, been examined and the, and the discs in their spine, the vertebra of their spine, have compressed and dissolved due to the weight of the armour they used to wear. So this stuff used to be really, really heavy and I'm incredibly lucky because it's not even, you know, um, an eighth as heavy as that stuff would have been. But it certainly has um, a real uh, uh, it, 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 authenticity to it. Um, they try to make it as real as possible. And yeah, you know, I think you're realizing I pretty much love every aspect of this. <laughs> <laughs>